Hi, my name is Chad Nelson, and I'm a Dynamics 365 Customer Engagement Solution Specialist with Western Computer. In this video, we're going to review setting up an entitlement. We'll begin by logging into the service module of Dynamics 365 Customer Engagement, and we'll head on over to the service management portion under settings. On the right hand side here, you can see entitlements. So we'll click on entitlements. I've gone ahead and pre populated one for us. So click on priority support here. And so you can see we've named this priority support. We've denoted who the primary customer is. We've got a start date, end date, and we can restrict based on entitlement terms. There's an SLA associated with this one. Service priority is the SLA, the owner. And then there's the entitlement terms, which is what we were speaking of over here. There's number of cases or hours. With cases, we're able to do it based on either creation or resolution. With hours, it's just resolution. So we'll click creation there. We've denoted the products related to this entitlement. We will hit save. And we will activate this. And then we will set this as the default. So hit default here, which will allow it to pre-populate whenever a case is created. Once active, entitlements can then be referenced against cases. Let's take a look here. So I'll go to service, we'll go to cases, I'll click phone support. I'll denote this as AC, we'll call this AC unit. Is blowing hot air. Customers. And so you can see once I hit save, it auto populates the entitlement because we marked it as the default one. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay alert of all the latest video releases surrounding Microsoft Dynamics 365 customer engagement.